long last you're returning from Reno, and while there may not be anyone waiting for you at the station this time, the freedom feels liberating, not lonely. A west-worn cotton twill suit set in handsome hazel brown with golden top stitching and carved wooden buttons pairs well with a wide faux straw hat to shield you from the summer sun. An embossed leather handbag and cognac leather heels finish the smart traveling ensemble, but you're finally only a cab ride away from home. You knew it would be an uphill climb starting work at the museum, but you didn't realize they thought you a mere socialite hardly fit to secretary. Still, a little time in the archives department gives you a chance to get the lay of the land in a slim-cut burgundy pencil skirt and beige blouse in softest silk. A beret keeps your head warm down there in the basement, and leather accessories keep the ensemble suitably studious. Now it's time to climb more than the library's ladder. A casual lunch date with that sweet entomologist may be a farce worthy of feeling uh, creepy crawly about, but with folks already asking questions, it's a play you'll have to put on as a precaution. Throwing off suspicions of breeze in this linen and rayon blend valero suit paired with a batik cotton button back blouse. Pin on a tilted halo hat with full face front veil, so poor bug boy here will be tempted to try a kiss. Hopefully anyone paying too much attention will turn their gossiping lips elsewhere as well. Finally promoted to the press department, you're still inching your way around to your desired post. But in more adventure-ready wear like this darling rayon blouse and crisp natural linen skirt, they'll be sending you on assignment in no time, surely. A stamped leather clutch pairs perfectly with prim gloves in a similar shade, and match marvelously with your canvas and leather lace-ups ready to take on excursions much further afoot from the office. Forward into the field, dusting off fossilized ferns wasn't exactly what you had in mind when you asked for more far-flung assignments, but your trousers from all that time out there on the ranch have already come in handy once again. Pair the hard-working twill with a silk blouse in its strongest of shoulders. Then lace up your best boots and dig into the detritus yourself on the search for more dinosaurs instead. You'll need a real scoop sooner rather than later, after all. It sure makes for a dramatic change, too, when you slip into this magnolia print floral dress and textured woven linen for the museum's annual Sculpture Garden Party fundraising event. Pair the divine dress with black straw accessories, a gargantuan veiled hat, and similar clutch handbag, perhaps. Crocheted gloves and a strand of fun beads from famed designer Miriam Haskells keep the ensemble firmly feminine for anyone still asking their silly, <laughs> silly questions. <clears throat> But now that you've turned on the charm, it's more frills for a meeting with the curator of special projects. Try a sleek rayon and deepest brown with festoons of wisteria. Pair with softest blue gloves to match the print and pin on a jaunty saucer hat filled with festive flowers. The curator's curious, and she may just have the director's ear. After all, it's in everyone's interest to keep doting donors clamoring for news of delightful discoveries. But she sent you to meet the man himself at his club, though they hardly wanted to let you in in your trousers. Pair those lightweight wool trousers with a tropical print rayon blouse and shades of serenest green. A leather belt and penny loafers confirm to your companions you're one of the boys too when, when need be. And keeping them laughing and the whiskey flowing ensures your little meander into the masculine helps you sitch the deal once and for all. And it's a triumph, you're finally on your way. To the airport then at once in your splendid arrow suit jacket and jaunty pleated skirt in terrific tan toffee. A novelty straw and feather topper tempts even the errant eye upward and coordinates well with your charming cord clutch in deepest chocolate brown. Stamped crocodile heels finish the ensemble and with that it's ta-ta to this tired town for the summer. Though you may just send her a postcard before takeoff so she'll know how to find you.
The excavations outside Naples may have struck marble with the intact temple facade, sure, but who cares when it's really the head of antiquities you're there to see? You'll write it all up, certainly, but only after an aperitif, or several. Landing in Napoli, you're sure to draw some attention in your striking scarlet wrap dress, but you did tell her you'd be waiting in red. Ivory straw and matching celluloid accessories keep the look decadently decent, but decency's right off the menu when your dearest discovers your hands decidedly ringless. It's more than the rest of your summer that's hers, and now any more whispers will be entirely ignorable in inintelligible Italian. A new chapter begins on the wings of your whims, but what they whisper to the winds as you both sigh, we've won, is just see, now that's amore. Ciao, ciao.